Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Hope you all had a good New Year's and a good Christmas. Now seeing as it's January, we're all going through this detox phase. You know, to shed off all of those sort of junk and things we've been eating throughout the Christmas period. Not necessarily junk, but you know, we've been eating quite a lot, I have. And um, just to kick start the year on a healthy note. And I'll be sharing with you guys some of my favourite detox recipes. I've given you guys a bit of variety and you know things that I like and hopefully you guys like too I'm sure of you might be familiar with some of the recipes some of you might not but then these are just great recipes that you can incorporate into your diet you know it's a great way to start the year I'll be using a lot of fresh produce and some good ingredients so it's not just about flushing out impurities as detox is known for but it's also using ingredients that actually benefit the body and that's very important we want to benefit our body and take care of it and it's all part of a healthy balanced diet so yes guys without further ado, without further ado and without me rambling on let's get started <laughs> Okay, so I have here two of my detox water. I have my cucumber, mint and lemon. And I also have my strawberry, blueberry and orange cleansing water. Now I'm gonna show you how to make the first one. Now I have here four strawberries. I also have a handful of blueberries and one orange that I've sliced up. Now I'm gonna slice my strawberries as well. And I'm going to just take the stalk off there. Don't forget to do that. And I'm just gonna add all of this to my water mix. I've also sliced off my blueberries here and we're just going to add all of them to a glass. These will make about a glass of water and I'm going to add about 12 ounces of water. And I'm just going to shake that for you so you guys can get a better look. And now I'm going to add about a teaspoon of stevia. This is just a great sweetener for the water. And there you have it guys. <laughs> now over to our mint and citrus water. I have here a handful of mint. I also have one cubie that I've sliced up by lemon and my half a cucumber. Now just like the one before we're going to add all our ingredients to our bottle, to your glass. Now cucumbers are very very beneficial and so are lemons and they're very great for you know getting rid of that bloated feeling. I'm just adding about 12 ounces of water here and there we have it. I'm also add a bit of mint just for freshness and a teaspoon of stevia. I would recommend leaving this for about 24 hours so it can infuse and so you can get a lot of benefits from these ingredients. And there you have it guys, my two detox water. Like I said, it's best to leave this overnight so you can get the benefits. And what I do is with the fruits, I just add them to a smoothie so they don't go to waste. So now guys, we're going to move over to our teas. The first tea I have is my ginger and lemon tea. I think it's a great detox. What you need is one lemon about an inch of or centimetre of ginger and some cayenne pepper and now I'm just squeezing my lemon just going to get right in there just to get all the juices and I'm just going to slice and chop my ginger and I'm going to add it to my motor and pesto I absolutely love this because I get to grind all my ingredients so we're just going to grind our ginger and add a bit of lemon just so it can make it a bit more liquidy there we have it and then I'm going to add my cayenne and turmeric There you have it guys, I have about a teaspoon of the ginger and lemon mix and I'm just going to use a strainer and a spoon just to squeeze out all the ginger because you don't want to get stuck in your throat and I'm going to add some hot water to that and you could just finish off with your lemon and there you have it guys, your lemon and ginger tea is absolutely great and you can have it any time of the day.
Now we're going to move over to our cinnamon green tea. What you need is one organic green tea. I prefer organic to normal store-bought green tea because it has a lot of caffeine in it and it doesn't give you that much benefit. But yeah, one organic green tea bag, some mint leaves and two cinnamon sticks. And now I'm just adding that to a pot of boiling water. I think this is a great way to really infuse the water with some cinnamon. And there you have it, you can see it's changed colour. You're just going to add that to your mug, or here I have a jar, which I'm going to now pour into my mug with my bag inside. So there we go, my bag. <laughs> then we're just going to finish off with some mint leaves for a nice kick and some honey. Don't forget to add your honey, it's absolutely delicious. And if you don't have time, you can just add all of them to your mug and just pour over some hot water and leave it to set for about two to three minutes so you can really get those nutrients or those flavours in. And there you have it guys. Now over to our detox smoothies. I have here with me my green detox smoothie. I absolutely love this smoothie. I have it for breakfast quite a lot. And all we just have is some kale, some spinach, some grapes and some apples. And over there some chia seeds and finally my green tea. Now this is an absolute go-to detox recipe. Now you're just going to add all your ingredients into a blender. I have there my kale, spinach, grapes and now my apple. And I'm just going to squeeze some lime. Guys, you need some lime for that kick. And finish off with my chia seeds. I think these are great because they swell up to twice, three times their size. And it really does fill you up. So this is great for breakfast. And you're just going to blend all of that together for about a minute or so. You can add more water to it as well. And there you have it, guys. You're my green smoothie, green detox smoothie. Now over to my carrot cleanse smoothie, I call it carrot cleanse because it really does do a good job. And here I have my spinach, my kale, my carrots. Now kale and carrots are in season and it's very important when you're doing detox smoothies that you use, try and use produce that are in season so we can get the full benefits. I also have this some squeezed lemon and a bit of lime. Now we'll also be using some oranges and some grapefruit just for that citrus kick and these two have a lot of benefit and they do help with the cleansing process now you're just going to chop all of them and add them into your blender or your smoothie maker so now i'm just going to add my lemon juice freshly squeezed lemon and i've used about half of that and i'm just going to pour that over followed by eight ounces of water which is basically like a glass of water and there we have it i'm going to add about a teaspoon of cayenne pepper and finish off with some honey for that sweetness and i'm going to blend it all together now And there you have it guys, my carrot cleanse smoothie. I absolutely love this and it might not look that appetising, but it definitely tastes good. Most importantly, it gives you those vitamins that you need. Last but not least, we have my cranberry juice and I absolutely love cranberry juice. So not many people know this, but cranberry juice is actually a very good detoxing juice and it gets rid of all those impurities and all of those things. So guys, do give this a try and if it's too sweet, add your water. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it useful. Let me know some of your detox tips. You can all leave them down in the comment section below. And yeah. Have fun detoxing and getting started with this new year. And until next time, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>